on a different topic, um, HHS uh, this, uh, about an hour or so ago confirmed that a, uh, a, a migrant, a 7-year-old boy, uh, died in, in HHS custody a couple of days ago, has been in custody for a number of weeks, we've been told. Um, has the President been briefed on that incident, um, and is there concerns that the system isn't prepared to handle uh, all the people who are being uh, inter interdicted right now at, at the border and, and maintaining custody and as, as a result of the ruling tonight, has he ordered any sort of investigation? So uh, thank you for the question. It is, uh, it is sad news. It's deeply saddening to hear, and we are certainly aware of the tragic loss, and uh, our hearts go out to the family. Uh, and it is, uh, 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 as I just mentioned, being a mother and celebrating uh, Mother's Day on, on Sunday, uh, it is uh, very devastating news. Uh, there is a medical uh, investigation that was opened on May 10th, and so I don't want to get ahead of that. we got to let the investigation go through, and so any specific uh, questions, certainly I would have to refer you to H. HHS. I haven't actually spoken to the president about this, so I, I don't have any information if he, he's been briefed on this. But I can say that uh, there is a medical investigation that's, that was uh, that was open on May 10th, and we're just going to let that go. I think I'm getting the sign for the pool. So if the pool wants to, uh, which way should, should they should they should exit this way to the left. Would the, would the president try to reach out to the family of? of, of so. I I don't have anything to preview at this time. Obviously, we are saddened, very saddened by, by, this, uh, by this loss and by the news, and just don't have anything to share about an outreach from the President on this.